But you what about your parents? Did they worry about you? My parents were alcoholic. I had an alcoholic father, and, and they didn't really pay attention. They weren't in control. Yeah. Um, for me, it was good to be out of the house. I, there you go. Yeah. So for me, it was it was a reprieve to be away. You could you could you had a sanctuary when you were running. One time, I ran an afternoon run after school in this winter and there was a blizzard and I was trying to make it to the top of uh, Beacon Hill for the first time and it was a tough, tough journey and I made it up the first time and on the way back down I got in, caught in an avalanche actually I caused it because I was running too far out on the lip of the road and the ice and the ice broke and I avalanched into the, the valley and I didn't get home till like 3.30 in the morning digging my way out I thought I was dead I had an out of body experience where I came out of my body, floated up to a tree, and I was looking at that little kid dying down in this in this hole, and and said that I wanted to die in a running motion because someday it would inspire some kid because I died, kept running right to death. So I got back down into my body and I started this running motion, yeah? not hoping to get out, just hoping to die running. And about two o'clock in the morning, I, I hit the, the lip of the road and it woke me up. And it says, I'm back up. I rolled over onto the road and I said, I'm alive, I'm alive. Yeah? And, and got home about 3.30 in the morning and nobody even knew. I could have been gone, you know, out there dead in the snow for days and my, my, somebody would have had to tell my parents, hey, by the way, your kid's out there in the you snow. Know.